Hi there, so glad you could join us. Today on Trick Time, we're playing the memory game. This is a brain game where we're asking the dog to watch and pay attention to what we're doing. This is a precursor to playing the shell game later on. So go sit, sit, wait. Here's what it looks like. Get it, good boy. In this trick, the handler places a treat in one of three baskets or containers while the dog watches. When released, the dog goes to the correct container and gets the treat. Your video should show the dog finding the treat at least twice in two different baskets. Now the container can be anything that you want. It can be three baskets, cups, bowls, or other containers that the dog can easily reach into to get a treat. Choose the size according to your dog. I'm using three small dog bowls today. To play this game, it can be helpful if your dog already knows how to sit and stay or wait. Even if he doesn't though, you can still play, but you might need a helper to restrain your dog gently while you set things up. To begin with, we'll only use two containers. Place your dog in a sit stay and put the containers on the ground between you and the dog. With your dog watching, deliberately place a tasty treat into one of the containers. Release your dog and tell him to get it. If he goes to the right container, yay, he gets a treat. Put him back in the starting position and try again. You'll want to vary which container that you place the treat in, but don't specifically alternate containers. To start, I'm just using two containers. Good puppy. We'll take a treat and with the dog watching, we place it in one. Release the dog and tell him to get it. Good boy, good for you. Now put the dog back in position. Sit. Subtle sit. Wait. And let's try it again. We'll use a different container this time. Good boy. Good for you. If your dog goes to the wrong container, just say something like, oopsie. Show him the empty container and return your dog to the starting position and start again. Remember that this is a memory game, not a search and find game. So when a wrong container is chosen, there's simply no reward. The dog is not permitted to keep searching and move on to other containers. Just start over. The reward is for remembering. Once your dog is consistently correct with two containers, add in a third one. Most dogs adapt quickly to an extra container, but others need more practice. When your dog's gotten good with two bowls, we add the third one and do exactly the same thing. Get it! Good puppy! Back up, back, back, back. Sit. Wait. When your dog is getting really good at it, you can make the game more challenging by placing the containers farther away or farther apart. You can also ask the dog to wait several seconds or longer before being released, so he really has to pay attention and remember. That's all for today. Have fun with your training and come play with us again.